My name is Jeff Marquez. I'm a naturalist for the Galapagos Islands and I work for uh, Silver Sea Expeditions. I'm Javier Chacon. I am I'm a naturalist in the Galapagos Islands and I work on board of the Silver Origin. Growing up in the Galapagos, it was quiet, very quiet. It was very calm. You feel safety and it's just nature and you and, and nothing more than that. The Galapagos Islands are a special place in the world with unique species found nowhere else but here. My parents came to the Galapagos Islands. They were researchers at the Charles Darwin Research Station for almost three decades. When I was born here, I had the wonderful opportunity to learn from my father about the conservation facts of the different species found in, in the Galapagos Islands. For me as a naturalist is to make everybody understand that it doesn't matter from where you come from, everything, it ends up being connected. You can be from a completely different place, but you can be influenced by what's happening here. And Silver Sea gave me this opportunity to teach our guests about it. The Galapagos Islands has one of the most important marine reserves of the planet. Now, one of the uh, main activities we have is deep water snorkeling that will give us the opportunity to explore the underwater world of the Galapagos. My highlight was when we went snorkeling. We'd never really even done snorkeling before, so to be in a place where you're with sea lions and, and turtles and you know all kinds of colorful fish was just amazing. Punta Vicente Roca is one of my favorite snorkeling places because it has a wonderful combination of Pacific green sea turtles, Galapagos penguins, lifeless cormorants and Galapagos sea lions in exactly the same place and all of this combined with the presence of different reef fish species which tend to be the perfect contrast and perfect addition to this wonderful experience. The expedition staff are really incredible. They have an unbelievable knowledge um, about the area. Without them and without people looking after these amazing islands we won't be able to be here. We want to preserve something, a destination that is very magic for the world, not just for visitors who come here, but for the world. And the protection and conservation of the Galapagos Marine Reserve will ensure that all this magic will be preserved for the future generations. Being conscious about your impact, I think, is really important. And if people want to keep enjoying the islands, I mean, that's the only way to do it, really. It has to be done in a really sustainable manner. I always believe that uh, major changes start with simple things. Things like don't use that much plastic, reuse your towel, then we're not going to get anything bigger than that. So my legacy is I want to see my son doing the same, but more on top of that. If I get to see that, then I think my legacy will be good enough.